I'll tell you what, I seem to just be having no luck when it comes to cutters that can cut thicker material like shrink plastic. I am just having no luck. It is insane. Um, today's experience is with the uh, Black Cat Cougar 13 inch, which I have right here. I bought this used from someone whom I'm given to understand is bought used. Please excuse the mess. I'm actually in the middle of rearranging just so I can have room for this sucker. So there's paper everywhere worse than usual. On the bright side, the place is getting vacuumed and reset. Haha. <laughs> anyway, and I have it here. I have it set up for my first print and cut. This is just a test sheet I did. I want to see if it will cut through plastic that I use to make charms and the image that I put inside the resin. And uh, so, you know, it's going to be a learning curve, just like all the others, and I'm getting there. Uh, the machine's got some damage to it. It's missing a screw here. Um, that's okay. Uh, <laughs> I will figure that out as well. I, I used to build bicycles with my dad and stuff. I'm, you know, not, not a major, you know, mechanic, but I, I, I can get by. And... Uh, so let me tell you my experience with the black cat and how I have been treated over the past year as I worked to get my act together to actually buy one. As you know, they're exper they are expensive. They're very expensive. If you don't know, they're one of the top of the line cutters. So when you're paying out money for these cutters, you're really paying. And... Uh, at the time, I don't think they make the Cougar anymore, which is the one I've been coveting. Um, they've got the Silver Bullet, which is one I really like, but I don't have a $1,000. And uh, back when I looked like I was going to be able to save the money because I had a friend who was going to help me purchase one, knowing that I wanted it for business purposes and just couldn't get up the funds, um, I found the uh, Black Cat... Uh, sales rep and I'm gonna look it up that's what I'm doing right now so I can tell you the website silverbulletcutters.com now the black cat and silver bullet are from that scrap incorporated but at the time you know I'm looking for a sales rep not the company itself and the only one in the United States that's pretty prominent that I had found at the time was silverbulletcutters.com and I would go to silverbulletcutters.com often because they, you know, they would have stuff up. And I'll show you the website. Of course, this is, uh, it's been revamped since last I was here. I believe it was, no, it wasn't silverbulletcutters.com. It was, it was this stupid camera being a pain in my butt. Uh... Not K and K, black cat cutters maybe. Oh, I'm sorry, it's taking me a while and make sure. Yeah, it's blackcatcutters.com. That's where I've been going. And you see this website. And I would click here, for example, to see this. And that's what you get. Internal server error. Um internal server error. Internal server error. And you know, so I would contact us, and it's there in Cleveland, apparently. I believe this is the UK. Okay, fine. But they have U.S. branches, and I had found the U.S. branch, and I had emailed numerous times asking questions because with the fiasco with the puzzles, if I got enough money to get yet another cutter, I wanted to make sure I wasn't making a mistake. Never, not a single one of my emails, not a one, were responded to. And that's how I was treated as a potential U.S. contact in the U.S. branch customer. Um, apparently, my concerns were not important enough to be discussed so that I could decide if this was the cutter for me. And... Uh, <laughs> So the only response I've ever gotten in the past year, year and a half, is uh, I emailed the U.S. branch because I was getting internal server errors like what you saw with the U.K. 
And I said, I really want to see the stuff, but I'm getting internal server errors and cannot see. Do you have a brochure? And what I got was a very hastily typed, uh, the links work. So I was in the shortcuts sure law forum and somebody was putting their black cat cougar up for sale used. They stated that they also had bought it used and they were saying 500 or best offer. I had 450. Of course, now I'm seeing where people are selling them for 300. And this one's slightly broken, but that's okay as long as I've been wanting one and I'll cope. So I'm, but you know, there's no booklet and I'm trying to find how to's and how to work this machine without breaking it and to do my first print and cut. And I found the black cat, you know, how to forum. I, I don't remember what it's called. I'll look it up really quick. Uh, the black cat cutters learning center. And in order to see the tutorials on how to work this machine, you have to register, they said, because people are taking their copyrighted information. All right, in order to register, you have to prove that you have bought your cutter legitimately. It's starting to sound a lot worse than Microsoft at this point. And so I went ahead and registered, and they asked, where did I buy the cutter from? And I said it was a private use sale. And this is what I got in response not very many minutes after. I just received your application to the Learning Center. You say it is a private sale used machine. We would need to know who the machine was purchased from and verify that the original purchase came from an authorized dealer. Please refer to this used machine policy here. If it can be verified as an authorized machine, then you may purchase the warranty plan to receive software and the warranty of a new machine via Sherry copied above. If you have questions, please feel free to contact me directly. Meantime, the application will be denied per policy. So, in a year, year and a half, I have been not treated very well by this company with these machines that are supposed to be oh so awesome. And I'm beginning to wonder what the heck do I have to be born with a silver spoon in my mouth to get treated with respect as a customer? I mean, sure, my machine is used, but uh, what the fuck? <laughs> how, how rude. I just, ah. Uh, um, so this is my response, not yet sent. Um... Hi there, the sale was made through the Scal forum with a private user who I am given to understand also bought it used. I can give you the serial, but I am seeing here it's probably a waste of my time. I would have bought a machine a year ago when I had had the money brand new, but the sales rep I emailed never answered me, and now with no money left, I get what I can. So I'll just chalk this up to yet another bit of experience in regards to this cutter. No biggie. I just wanted to learn how to set the cutter up so I could do my first print and cut. I'll figure this thing out eventually. Have a wonderful day and thank you for your time, the time you took for this <laughs> thoughtful email. Uh, I have not got a very high opinion of the company after all this time. It has been months. It has been months. Um... And that's why I got that stinking Pazzles that, by the way, still doesn't print and cut. I have updated the driver on that Pazzles. I have done everything you're supposed to. If I tell it to print and cut now, what it does is it just runs the paper through and keeps feeding and feeding and feeding. It doesn't even try. Whereas with the older drivers, at least it used to try. Um, and this, and, and I'm recording to you on a brand new Windows 7 um, Ultimate machine that's like a month and a half old. So it's not my machine. It's, that's, that puzzle's been on four different machines so far. It's not my machines. Uh, so I don't know what to say. I, I, I'm hoping this, this Black Cat Cougar will work. And I'm scouring the internet looking for good tutorials that aren't full of people who either too, talk too fast or are just morons. And um, I found a few things. I've got started. I'm I'm working on it. But yeah, I'm 
I'm really disappointed in the company and it almost makes me glad that I didn't buy the thing brand new because with the way I've been treated trying to buy one brand new, I can't imagine how they kicked me to the curb once they got my money.